Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel and my Let's Play The Sims 3 Castaways Challenge. It has been quite some time since I've played Sims 3. It's kind of been quite some time since I've played Sims. I've been having some personal things going on in my life. I have had a sick cat and I've been spending most of my time taking care of my cat. But I'm going to try and get back to recording um, Let's Plays on a regular basis. I have really missed it and I've really missed playing Sims in general. So we are getting back to the castaways now. Uh, Sarah is um, pregnant. They have not had their first child yet, but I'm suspecting that either in this episode or the very next episode, Sarah will have her first child. We already have $11,000 saved up and we have everything in this cabin that we need for Sarah and Trevor that we can move on and take Vivian and Denver to their new home. So, we are just going to wait until Sarah has those babies. We, she needs to have at least two babies before we can move Vivian and Denver out. What is Trevor doing over here? Oh, he's using the restroom. And then he's going to get something to eat and go to bed. Okay. Um, there are puddles everywhere, apparently. Let's see. It is 12.30 a.m. I'm not sure why Trevor is still awake. Oh, and it looks like... Oh, he's got one day before he becomes um, an adult. Sarah... It's her birthday today. Vivian, she has a birthday in three days, and Denver has a birthday in five days. So hopefully, as soon as Sarah has the baby that she's currently pregnant with, we will get her pregnant again. Let's see if anybody is going to be waking up. Otherwise, we will probably jump ahead yep okay so I'm gonna go ahead and jump ahead to when every somebody wakes up okay so I will be right back okay so Sarah well yes I thought Sarah would be waking up any second okay somebody's waking up it is Vivian okay so Vivian, how about we have you come downstairs and serve some breakfast? Organic pancakes. Oh, and by the way, I did go ahead and send gifts to those of you who have sent me gifts. I did not receive the gifts uh, that were sent here because we can't really use them in the castaways. So I will wait until I get back into... Uh, Life on the Farm Challenge before I receive those gifts. But I did send gifts to those of you who sent gifts to me. So if you'd like to send me some gifts in Sims 3, uh, my username is Miss Aerobics, and I will be happy to send some gifts back to you as well. Okay, so Denver is awake. He's going to go check out the chickens, I think. He's going to play with the chicks, okay. How about you can play with the chicks, but before you do that, how about you harvest the eggs and feed the chickens? And then you can play with the chicks. And Vivian is serving breakfast. Let's come over here and watch Denver play with the chicks. I think I am going to turn my edge scrolling back on. I think I figured out why um, my edge scrolling is so 
wild in mm -hmm. Sims 3. Um, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But I think it's because of my because of how I have Ooh. my settings on my Mac because I do mm -hmm. run Sims 3 and also now Sims 4 on my Mac. And I have my mouse set very sensitive and I think that was what was causing my my when I do edge scrolling to kind of go way out of the way. So Sarah, she's not looking that big. So she it she might be another episode before she is um gives birth to those babies. Oh, what, did she tell the chicken a joke? Is that what she did? <laughs> I have no idea what she was doing. Now she's going to talk to Denver. Yeah, and we need to get their relationships up a bit. I think that uh, we do have the relationships with Max and Ellen up a bit. But even even these guys that are still living together in the same house, their relationships are not that good. So we are going to try and work on that in the next couple of days as well. Because, again... Denver and Vivian's kids are going to end up marrying and and um, being friends with Sarah and Trevor's kids and what have you. So Denver wants to go fishing, which is good. Oh, he got a he got a um he got an egg. He got a an exotic egg. Sure, we'll let Vivian <laughs> chat with, with Ellen. And we'll have him go fishing. Let's see if Sarah is kind of hungry. So let's go ahead and send her over here to grab a plate. And I'm pretty sure Trevor's still sleeping, but we'll have him grab a plate when he gets up as well. And Denver, you can grab a plate also. Did you finish eating, Vivian? When you're done, why don't you go ahead and clean the stove? And that bird is still over there. I just think that is wild. Anyway, so, like I said, we're waiting for Sarah to have a baby. And we, we actually can... Um, work on Vivian's painting as well. I'm pretty sure... Yeah, these guys... Are these guys married? Yes, they are married. Now, these guys are just boyfriend and girlfriend. Um, Vivian and Denver. Which is fine, because they're not going to be having any kids until they move into their own house. Sarah... What can Sarah do today? She wants to improve her gardening skills, so, well, I don't really, uh, we'll just let her tend garden, and we'll get Trevor to also tend garden. We'll send him out here and start working. If there's anything to do. And Vivian, You just talk to Ellen. You're going to do something with the chickens. How about you just tend garden? And we will send Denver fishing because he wants to go fishing. Oh, by the way, these guys have jobs. Sarah is on maternity leave, so she doesn't have to go. And Trevor, his job starts in 23 hours. So we've got time. And, of course, forgot to set the timer. <laughs> I had it all ready to go, and then I forgot. And Denver, I will send you... What are you going to do with the cow? Play tic-tac-toe? Uh, I don't think so. How about... Let's see. Can we come down over here and fish? No, I don't think we can get down there. All right. Let's see. Where else can we fish? 
This is the Garden of Eden over here. We fish there a lot. Um, let's see if there's anything along this edge here. I don't think we've gone to this area very often. I'm pretty sure that we've caught most of... Let's use an egg. <laughs> Utterly ridiculous. I don't think I've ever used an egg for fishing. And of course, we do not have the books. So we can't find out what each fish likes to um, to use. Oh, she's talking to the baby. <laughs> when, what are you going to do now? Play tic-tac-toe. And I'm not sure if um, Sarah would be able to take care of the bees. Oh, Vivian's going to scare her. I'm going to send Trevor over here to um, feed the bees, smoke the box, harvest the honey, and clean the box. And then we'll, send, we'll get Vivian over here to chat with Sarah. Let's friendly enthuse about fishing. Let's chat with her. Katabi. Oh, oh, but he's down. Apparently, we have to wait till Sarah is done playing. That's fine. Oh yeah, feel her tummy. <laughs> Ask her about her day. Vivian wants to learn the writing skill, but there's no computer, so there's no writing skill just yet. You sunija, arbalev, nognash, totally go on. Talk about composting. Okay, what's Trevor doing? Okay, is he done? Wow, no bee stings or nothing. Okie dokie. Now what are you gonna do? Oh, you're gonna tip the cow. Okay, let's see if you could do it. This will be interesting. This will be interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that didn't work. Are you going to try again? Yeah, you're going to try again. <laughs> I wonder if they ever are able to do it. <laughs> Cow tipping fail. Okay, well... Denver is fishing. We could always send... He wants to get pumped. Maybe we can go running. We don't have any um, exercise equipment or anything like that. The carpool's not coming for Sarah. I don't know what you're talking about. He learned logic? He learned logic? Did he learn logic by playing tic-tac-toe with a cow? Really? Us? No way. What's he doing now? Oh, oh he's going to feed. He, he doesn't want that. Okay. Feed the cow. Feed the cow vegetables. Oh, he's going to tip the cow again. Oh, he did it! <laughs> I guess it just takes practice. Oh, that's funny. Let's try that again. Let's tip the cow. Let's see if he can get it. He probably won't get it. Now that I now that I'm ready for a picture. Nope, of course not. Let's try again. Tip the cow again. Sure. No. Nope. Okay, let's try one more time. Maybe third time's the charm. 
Go on. Go on, Trevor. One more time. Nope. <laughs> so much for that idea. Alrighty. You still had fun with that. Okay, you want to find a rock. Do we have any rocks around here? I know that there's rocks in the Garden of Eden, but do we have any rocks that are close to our house here. I don't know. I don't think so. Okay. I don't see anything as I scan the horizon. So, what else can we do? Oh, he would like to buy a telescope, but we need to have full logic first. Um, and I believe that we need to, I believe that we need to master the science career before we can buy a telescope. I'm going to actually take that and throw that out. And let's go ahead and have him hug Sarah. He wants to hug her. And Denver, what have you um, caught, dear sir? Yeah, you're not doing bad. What What are your skill or your um, needs? You're doing pretty good. Let's see what Trevor needs to do for his job. Oh, he needs to garden, so that's good. Um, prepare a meal with honey. So he's got his gardening skills, and his his job starts in 17 hours. Maybe they can play chess together. Play chess with your wife. And Vivian is painting again, which is fabulous because all the chickens have grown up, all the chicks. Vivian is painting again, so we can... Oh, I think that was a, um, I was, I thought that was a painting that Vivian did and it was pretty nice. But no, this was actually a wedding gift that Sarah and Trevor got. So that's kind of cool. And I'm not exactly sure what Vivian's painting, but I love the colors. And her painting oh, skill is really? also getting quite high as well. Hmm. Yes, she's Not just about to level eight. Okay, so Denver wants to be worth $35,000. Oh, he's pretty close. Let's go ahead and give him that. He wants to clean the stove, which Trevor or somebody else already did. I think, yep. Um, okay, so Vivian finished your painting. You can go ahead and clean the... Did you finish it yet? You did. Clean that first. And how much is that worth? $320. That's not bad. Um, I like that picture, though. I think I'm going to just put it in your inventory for right now. And we can sell some of these things, I think. Actually, I'll put some in the refrigerator. That's fine. Mm. We want to keep the... Nursky, nursky. Huh? Oh, we are going to want to keep do. some of these things when we move them out too. So I think for right now we, mm. won't, we won't move anything out <laughs> just yet. <laughs> we'll put these things in the refrigerator and we'll sell these. Well, Herbie... She wants to reach level four of logic skill. She's at level three. Wow. What is Vivian going to do now? She is going to play tic-tac-toe. I guess these guys don't have a lot going on. And they play tic-tac-toe with the cow a lot. But yeah, I don't know what... Oh, the baby's coming. The baby's coming. The baby's coming! So, she's going to be having a baby for a while. And Trevor's going to freak out. Oh, your rare exotic egg has gone bad. Okay. 
Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of that then. And he wants to warm up, so I'm going to send him home. And apparently I'm still having trouble with this scroll. Oh, here comes Vivian. Now she's going to freak out. It's not that big of a deal, people. Oh, so now that somebody else is freaking out, Trevor's like, okay, I've had enough of this. I'm out of here. Where are you going? Use the bathroom? Okay. You want to buy a telescope, but unfortunately, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. So I'm going to I'm gonna cancel that. So apparently, they only freak out for so long, and then they're like, okay, I'm on to something else now. Vivian would like to go to the park. She wants to paint something brilliant. Okay. Well, why don't you come in here and paint something brilliant then? Let's paint medium. And Denver should be home shortly. And we can... Oh, we... That's what we should have done. We should have used those tuna and... Um, oh, I can't sell his stuff yet. He wants to buy a high chair. Yeah, let's buy a high chair. And he wants to buy a stuffed animal too. Let's do that. I think I think that's reasonable. Let's buy go to the children's things. And he wants to buy a high chair. I don't know if it's gonna be a boy or a girl, so we're gonna try and get something gender gender neutral. And we will buy a toy as well. And I'm just going to get the general bear. That's good. One day, the baby will come. <laughs> and we will need a name for that baby. And let's see if I can pull up my my baby name generator. Let's see. And the baby is a boy. Well, geez, we have all these boys. I certainly hope that... Um, let's see, does Ellen... Yeah, Ellen and um, Max have all boys also, I think. So baby boy, let's generate name, Landon. So that's the new baby's name. And this time, and we're going to randomize the traits. And this time when Sarah gets pregnant, we are going to make sure that she has a girl. I hope. Do we have any watermelon? Uh, let's open this up. We need to have watermelon to have a girl. And apparently, we don't have any watermelon. Okay. Well, maybe we will, and maybe we won't. But we are going to need to have some girls at some point. Otherwise, we are not going to have any other kids around. That's not going to be a good thing. Let's see. Ellen... Let's see who Sarah. Oh yeah, Ellen and do they do have a girl, Tomika, Jordan, and um, Maxwell. So that's good. But we need to have some more girls. So what I think I'm going to do now that we have a grocery store because we did set up the grocery store. I'm going to send Trevor off. What's he going to do? He's going to play. He's going to play catch. All right. I'm going to send. Then I'm going to send um, Trevor to the grocery store because now that we do have the grocery store, because Sarah is the grocery store clerk, I'm going to send him off to buy groceries, and we are going to buy some watermelon so that when. Sarah gets pregnant again, we will have a girl. I don't typically like to do that. Are these, these guys are still in debt. 
This is just nuts. I need to find a way that my family is not in debt when I leave them. Anyway, I'm sending Trevor off to buy some groceries and we are just about out of time. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. He He's going to buy his groceries and get back home. But um, I will go ahead and end the episode here. And we will pick up next time when... Dial a mob. Mm. with the next episode and like I said as soon as Trevor gets back I will um, try and get Sarah pregnant um, all we want is watermelon we need a bunch of these and a bunch more to plant mm, that's probably good okay um So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode, but I will uh, go ahead and after I close out this episode, I will go ahead and woohoo Sarah and Trevor and get Sarah pregnant again and then have her eat all those watermelon so that hopefully she will have a girl the next time. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you are enjoying this Castaways Let's Play. And we are almost at the point where we're going to have three families going. And it's going to be wonderful. We're going to have uh, Max has a job. I don't know if he ever goes to his job, but he does have a job. And Trevor and, both, and Sarah both have jobs as well. So we are moving right along. So thanks so much for watching. And I will talk to you next time. Bye for now.